Hey guys, it's Jeremy from HowToHockey.com. In this video, I'm going to give you a few tips on how you can perfect that quick release. Let's get right to it. A quick release is something that every hockey player needs when they're in close to net. Because there's three things that could happen if you don't get that shot off quickly. Either the goalie is going to take it away, you're going to skate past that opening that you had, or somebody's going to come and lift up your stick or slide in front of that shot. So the key to getting a quick release, very simple, is just getting those hands away from the body, especially this top hand. Get that top hand away, and you cut the puck, and then pull back with that top hand and push forward with that bottom hand. So this is all you're doing, is getting that hand away and then pulling and pushing. So let's say this puck comes to me right here. All I'm gonna do is get this top hand away. Nice little snap, it's just that snap motion. You're using the leverage of the stick. So you're pulling back here, pushing there. And that one little snap is all you really need to send the puck on net. So I'll show you again. So the puck comes in here, just a quick little snap. Now I'll show you that quick release with the puck in three different locations. In front of my body, to the side of my body, and behind my body. So. With the puck in front of my body, it's like the wrist shot stance. Basically all we're doing is pulling the puck in, getting that hand away from the body. Then you want to lean on that stick a little bit and get your weight over top of the puck. So if you can get your weight over top of the blade, you can flex that stick and get a bit more snap. And you really drive in with that power arm. So really drive in right here and then pull back with that top hand, push with that bottom hand. It looks like this. Well, I just broke a puck in half. So I'm gonna say this was a defective puck, but still goes to show what I was talking about. Really lean on that stick, get your weight in that power arm, get your weight over this shot, and you're gonna have a much harder shot. Now I'm gonna show you the snapshot from the puck to your side. With the puck to the side, there's two ways you can do this. One is the quickest release, one is with a bit more power. So with the quick release, all you gotta do, pop that hand out and then take that snap. So you pop that top hand and then pull back and push with that bottom hand. For a bit more power, you're gonna be doing this while you're in stride. So you're skating, and once you see that opening on the right side, you're gonna transfer your weight over to this foot, and then get that snap. So while you're transferring the weight over onto that foot, you're putting your weight over top of the stick, and then you're pulling back and doing that same motion. Pull back with the top hand, push with the bottom hand. So I'll show you one more time. So the skating in, I'm gonna push from the leg furthest from the blade of my stick, transfer it onto the foot closest to the blade of the stick, and get that shot. You've learned that quick release in front of your body, learned the quick release to the side of your body, and now you can go home and practice the quick release from behind your body. You never know where you're going to get that puck where you need to just snap into the net. Maybe you get a re weird rebound or you're trying to deke the goalie and he slides way too soon and he gives you the other side of the net. You're going to have to pull that puck back, get a quick little snap. So practice getting rid of the puck right there. I'll show you what it looks like. If I'm skating across here, I get a re uh, good rebound, but I'm already skating this way. Just pull the puck back, get those hands away from your body, and get that snap. So that's the number one thing, just pull that elbow back and then pull and push. I'll show you that one more time. There you go, those tips will help you work on your quick release. If you're looking for more tips, check out howtohockey.com. That's our website, all kinds of articles and videos on improving your technique. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel and you'll be the first one to know when we release new videos. Also check out the iSnipe, it's an app for the iPhone and it'll help you uh, improve your shot quite a bit. Uh, thanks a lot for watching the videos. See you guys in the next one.